The free space. I want that Copa. No. <laughs> And now for our feature presentation. The Breeze, presented in CHS, where available. Hello once again everybody, Aubrey and Tiger here with you once again for another YouTube video. There's Tiger right there, he's looking at my VHS tapes. If you can see those, this time around we are going to do my Fox VHS tape collection today, in which I have a pretty good amount of these VHS tapes. I have quite a lot of Fox VHS tapes because I like 20th Century Fox, I like the films. And what we're going to do first is I'm going to go over the clamshell cases the films in clamshell cases first and then the ones in slip cases cardboard slip cover cases and once again ABC order based on in clamshell cases and uh, slip board, cardboard slip cover cases and yep once again there's Tiger my cat he'll be appearing in my videos frequently and so uh, while he's looking all around I'm going to show you the first VHS tape first one I have is Baby's Day Out. This is a 1994 VHS print, I believe. And it's uh, it's written and produced by John Hughes, the guy who made who produced films like Home Alone. And this is a comedy. This is a really funny movie. I used to watch this a lot when I was a kid. <laughs> but yeah, if you like kids, then you'll enjoy this movie. It's pretty good. And this tape has the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo and the 1992 Fox Video logo, or is it from 93? And then the the following film has been modified screen. Then the this is one of the last films to use the 20 the 1980s 20th Century Fox logo. This is one of the last ones to use it. And the next one I have is Far From Home: The Adventures of Yellow Dog. I believe this is from 1995. But this is a good movie. It's a film about a dog, and like I said, if you uh, if you're a fan of animals, if you like dogs, then this is a good movie for you to watch. Now the film is from 1994, but the VHS is from 95. Okay, and then the next one I have is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers the movie, another 1995 VHS. And I remember I saw this in the movie theaters when it first came out in 95. And I used to watch the TV show when I was in elementary school. And, um... I, stopped, I kind of stopped watching Power Rangers when I was like in third grade, but I still watch the movie occasionally. Because it's still pretty cool. <laughs> and Ivan Ooze, one of the villain, the main villain in this movie, he's... Ivan Ooze is one of the funniest villains, as far as I know. How you doing, Tiger? You see anything interesting? Well, I'll get to those tapes later on. Meantime, I'm going to finish up the clamshell cases. I have four of those left. Next is the 1995 VHS of Miracle on 34th Street. This is the 1994 John Hughes remake of the 1947 classic. I don't have the 1947 film. I don't have a VHS or DVD of that tape, but... I've seen it before, and I've seen this print, and the remake is actually pretty good. And look, they didn't put the rating on there. They forgot to put the rating on there, but it's rated PG. But it's still a Christmas classic. 
I mean, Miracle on 34th Street is always a Christmas classic. Next to It's a Wonderful Life. Alright, next I have a 1995 VHS of the Page Master with Macaulay Culkin. And this is a, it's a pretty good movie. It's a, a live action and animated. And it's got the voice talents of Whoopi Goldberg and Patrick Stewart and Leonard Nimoy. And uh, not only does Macaulay Culkin star in this, but Christopher Lloyd is also in the film. And this was one of the first tapes, this was one of the first films to feature the uh, 1990s CGI, the 1990s CGI 20th Century Fox logo. It was from 1994 when they first used it. And then they changed the fanfare in 1990, late 1997. Okay. Next I have here Rookie of the Year. This is a funny film. And this is from 1994. Now, Daniel Stern, who, was, uh, who used to narrate the TV show The Wonder Years and starred in the Home Alone films, he also... Um, he stars in this film, and he directs it. If you like sports comedies, then this film's definitely for you, but... I like this film, but between this and The Sandlot, I kind of like The Sandlot better. Sandlot's funnier. And speaking of which, I have The Sandlot. I'm fixing to cover that tape. That'll be my last claim showcase. You can find it. Here it is. It's a 1993 VHS of The Sandlot. No, it's from 1994. I'm sorry. The film's from 93. The tape's from 1994. The Sandlot. I always enjoy watching this movie. It is a true comedy. If you like baseball movies, and then you should definitely check this out. One of my favorite parts is when uh, the opposing team starts arguing with the people who play on The Sandlot. Like, you bop for apples in the toilet, and you like it. <laughs> That is my favorite line in the film. You bob for apples in the toilet, and you like it. And then when they go on that toboggan ride after chewing tobacco, oh man. <laughs> That's another funny part. But basically, Sandlot, very enjoyable movie. But those are all the Fox VHS tapes I have that are in claim show cases. I'm going to show you the ones that are in cardboard slipcover cases. Starting with... 20th Century Fox Selection VHS of Airheads with Adam Sandler, Brendan Fraser, and Steve Buscemi. This is from the year 2000. Now, I am a fan of Adam Sandler. He's really, really funny. Now, the VHS says it's from 1994. They use the original uh, sticker label for the Selections VHS. You like rock and roll? Check this out. And it's also funny. Because it has Adam Sandler and Brendan Fraser, who's from George of the Jungle. Next, I have another 20th Century Fox Selections video, and this is uh, Big with Tom Hanks. I know Videos for Everybody has this. This is from 1995, although the tape is from the film. It's a 1988 film. Wait a second. Wait a second. Hold on. Hold on. Casper, a spirited beginning? What? Something's not right here. Can someone tell me what's wrong with this picture? The cardboard slipcover case of Big? And they put in the tape for Casper, a spirited beginning? Oh my god. And I never noticed it till now. I guess because I have so many VHS tapes, it's hard to keep track of everything. And look, Tiger's climbing up there. I can't believe it! I got Casper a spirited beginning instead of big. Okay. Put this off to the side. I guess I'm going to have to find the real big tape sometime. I guess that's why whenever I go to pawn shops or Goodwill, I should check the tape label. Okay, so, aside from Big, let's go to the next one. This is a premiere series VHS of Bullworth with Warren Beatty and Holly Berry. This is from 1999. And this is a pretty funny movie. You know, if you're into 
politics. You don't have to like politics if you want to watch this movie. But Warren Beatty, he is a comedian. So, this one's alright, I guess. Recommend it. Except there's no previews on there. Just the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo, then the format screen, then the 20th Century Fox logo. I'm going to cover one more Fox VHS tape before we go into part two. And that's the 1994 VHS of The Chase with Charlie Sheen and Christy Swanson. This is an action-packed comedy. And it's also a pretty funny movie. I also remember recording this off Action Max. I have it on a blank DVD. I'll show those somewhere. But if you like chase movies and comedies, then this film's for you. Charlie Sheen, he's, you know, he's best for his for a show on, uh... Oh, what is that show? I, remember. I, I, I can't remember what the name of that show is. Two, two Men or something like that. I'll have to look it up. And Christy Swanson, she was in the movie Buffy the Vampire Slayer in 1992. Well, that'll do it for part one of my Fox VHS tape collection, but I will follow up with part two right after this, in which I still have a bunch more tapes to go over. So, I'll be back.